Hi guys, welcome to this short video about the question how much 3D printing is costing. So there are many discussions about that and I have found actually two extremes and I wanted to show you these two extremes. Especially if you don't have already a 3D printer, this could be really interesting for you. Of course, you have to buy a 3D printer, which is uh, from maybe $150 up to almost uh, anything, could be thousands of dollars. I would say you can get a real good 3D printer for most household items to print yourself for around $300. This is what you have to be expecting at the beginning but how much do you have to pay for such things i mean a lot of things you can get for free like 3d models i mean you can construct them on your own but you can find a lot especially the the largest uh, space which i have found is the thingiverse.com and you can go here and type for almost everything and you will find solutions for almost anything like here for a simple toothpaste squeezer i mean of course you could order that on amazon for like five or ten dollars with shipping the problem is the shipping of course uh, the biggest part of the money will be the shipping so it's much better or easier or more economical to print this thing yourself at home home if you have 3d model or you construct one so here we are with the model and when we go to uh, the file you can click always here down uh, for the files you can download everything or just the stl file we click on download and here we have the stl file now we have two options basically the two extremes i wanted to show you the first extreme which is here on the 3daddict.com. There's a 3D printing cost calculator. We can click here and then click on the STL file, which we have downloaded and it does some calculation. And after a couple of seconds, it will come up with the total estimated price of printing. In this case, it is 50 cents, which is of course a lot, but they are taking into account everything, even electricity, maintenance cost, uh, probably of the print, the filament cost and whatsoever. And they come up with 50 cents, which I think is incredibly high when we compare it to the cost of the material so the other way which i also recommend is to use the ultimaker ultimaker cure that's a free software i mean something which you can use for free uh, for personal use you can download use it uh, for free forever uh, there's no virus guaranteed when you install these things you can uh, do the same thing. You can download the STL file from here. Here we still have it. And then we can double click on it and it will open this thing in the Ultimaker Cura. And this is supposed to produce the actual printing file for the 3D printer. Usually it takes a little bit, especially in the last version. Uh, it has become a little bit slower. I hope they will speed up this in the next version. But what you get here is this 3D model. You can see that here and then you can select the options of infill support, adhesion, everything what you want and then and then slice it that's the thing here which you need uh, click on slice after you have chosen the right things like you can even apply a little bit of adhesion i mean this is a really flat thing and it doesn't need any extra adhesion so i just click on slice here and it will give me an estimate how long it will take to print and how much filament it is using and that's five grams and when we assume let's say an average of maybe twenty dollars per kilogram of filament that means every gram costs about two cents so with five grams uh, we are at about 10 cents so much lower of course also here the length of the filament which we are using so definitely way less than the 50 cents so i mean the truth is of course like always somewhere in between if you want to do see the 
total like maximum worst case cost which you can face yeah maybe you're close to 50 cents if you're saying i have the printer anyway i just want to uh, see the uh, actual cost of the filament and i mean uh, printing for one hour the electricity is maybe one cent uh, if, if if even that maybe maybe even less so actually if you're saying okay i just want to see how much filament or like how much the real printing cost is independent from buying a printer then that's the 10 cents here from the uh, ultimaker cura so these are the two extremes i just wanted to show you these uh, two options and i hope i've been able to help you a little bit with this video if you have any questions or comments or other opinions on that just let me know down in the feedback area i'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe my channel thanks for watching and see you next time